Easy Cumbria Kid into favouritism, 390 Nana Mania. This is the Bacini and Associates final, and the red goes to green, and here's the lure. It's over the 500 Nara. Race 8, they're set, ready. Away, Cumbria Kid up with the lids with Believe So and first to break French Vanilla from Cumbria Days. Uh, just getting off heels there was Star Present and they were followed making good yardage. Cumbria Kid now from Nana Mania going around them. Believe So had dropped out with Dynamic Queen past the Scribbly Gums. Cumbria Days by four or five lengths holding down second at the moment. French Vanilla then comes Cumbria Kid and Believe So running on when the race is all over but around the corner and racing away is Cumbria Days. It wins the final. Second, French Vanilla. Not sure. Third, believe so. Or Cumbria Kid. Leave that up to the judge. Then came Nana Mania. Star Present was well back with Dynamic Queen. And they've run the trip in 29.9. Cumbria Days for Steve Fitch. $5.350. French Vanilla, one ten. And one Cumbria Days, or just, or Cumbria Kid, I should say, will just get third ahead of Believe So. So third and fourth there. They've come up with the lead, so gave the others a big start. 4.44 on the clock, 17.04, and the run home, 12.90. Winner gets in by two and a quarter. So two and a quarter by one and three quarters. The winner prepared by Steve Fitch. And uh, Steve Fitch uh, had a... A couple, of, or a big hand in the uh, race. He obviously had Cumbria Kid in there as well. French Vanilla, John Reminis. Uh, good run to get second and Cumbria Kid third. More details to follow. So the winner, Cumbria Days. And Cumbria Days is by Fernando Bale. Hilltop Bell for Steve Fitch. The runner-up, Fernando Bale, Melissa's Pride. John Reminis and third going to Cumbria Kid, Fernando Bale Hilltop Bell, the little brother to the winner. If you've had a first four, believe so, my redeemer, Olivia's Tops. All righty, two and a quarter, one and three quarters, 29.94, 4.44, 17.04, 12.90. Basically, Cumbria Kid, believe so, they dawdled out. So too did Nana Mania. She wasn't as quick out as what she was here last week and uh, she went forward, but, uh, gee, the leader was travelling up the back, Cumbria Days, and he was able to hold French Vanilla, who showed good pace, good run, the second dog, and third and fourth, as we mentioned. They were slow out. They've made up plenty of ground. All right, uh, let's go to race nine. Uh, Black Jackist and Bandit Butch head the charts. It certainly uh, looks a match race here, and uh, Royal Austin in behind those. So race uh, nine, that's the heavy jet power at stud. Fourth and fifth grade due at 8.51. All right, all clear relays on the previous 7.412 race eight and recapping all clear.